For the second year in a row, EKU Women's Golf got together for a little selection show shindig. The ladies were all smiles as they found out they would be headed to Alabama for the regional round of the NCAA tournament. Here's Coach Whitson and a couple of his golfers after they found out they were heading south. Well, it's a great feeling. I mean, what, what this team accomplished last week, winning the Ohio Valley Conference again, um, was just a wonderful accomplishment. They just played great. And then tonight we had a little watch party. Uh, I told them at practice today, tonight's half celebration and half figuring out where our next uh, place of business is. And it looks like we're going to Birmingham, Alabama and play Shoal Creek. It feels great. I'm really proud of this team. We've done a lot and we've really worked hard. So I think we deserve this and I'm excited to see what we can do next week. Obviously, it's a little nerve-wracking to be going to regionals, but you know we've been there before as a team, and there are other, obviously other good teams, but when we get there, we just need to focus on Maroon and do what we can do. It feels great. Uh, we've been putting in a lot of hard work this semester and, and the previous semester as well, so it's really good when it finally uh, pays off. Like Coach said, we can only, if we only worry about Maroons because we can't really do anything about anyone else. Golf is a sport where you know you don't really look at the other schools, you know, you just got to go out there and do and do you. And so we're going to go down there and worry about Maroon and Maroon only. And we're going to do our job. The Colonels won the OVC tournament with a record-breaking score of 288 and will take their clubs to Shoal Creek Golf and Country Club, where the 18-hole course was designed by Jack Nicholas. I'm David Miller for EKU Sports.